Hello and welcome to your beauty -o. on the sofa this week because we're at the summer study, we're talking about something else, but don't worry, don't panic, it's still Sabutio. Sabutio is what you like, or you like collecting toys, or you like seeing some guy talk about random stuff, then this is the place for you, pure nostalgic joy. Drop me a subscribe, drop me a like on the video, drop me a dislike if you don't like it, all shows some sort of interest, doesn't it? If you want to see what else is going on in my world, I'm on Twitter, I'm on Instagram as well. I'm always uploading pictures of my collection on there as well. You'll find me at Sabutio Collector. But today, we're not actually talking about physical Sabutio. We're talking about football. The tabletop years, part one and part two. DVDs about predominantly Sabutio, but also about everything else, right? So. I was cruising around Sabutio World looking at stuff like you do, dreaming, and then I saw this football, the tabletop years, pop up, and I thought, you know what? I need that. So I've got it, watched it. It's wicked, it's well cool, all right? So I'm sitting there watching it, and it goes through the history of Sabutio, it goes through the history of table football, starts with blow football, starts with, they talk about Kasdan football, which I've never heard of before. There's like a bit at the end where it goes about different player types. So if you're one of the people that occasionally ask me about different player types, I'm not saying don't ask me because I like talking to people about Sabutio, but this DVD's got it on there as well. You can see him, go buy the DVD, it does it. It's absolutely brilliant. And of course, I wanted to talk about it on my channel. I didn't want to use that footage without permission, so I got I dropped him an email, got talking to him, and they tell me they're releasing a YouTube channel. It's more for Subutio on YouTube. Get in. So you'll now see, right? You'll now see Table Football Monthly. There's been three episodes so far. Uh, if you look on the last episode, most recent one nearest this video, September's edition, my ugly mug turns up. I'll tell you a little bit more about that in a minute, but what a good experience that was. So I'm emailing him, he's told me about this thing, yeah, he's invited me down, they said they're doing a YouTube channel. If you watch the channel, if you watch their channel, half an hour, it's a bit like Top Gear, right? A bit like Top Gear for um, Subutio, if you like. Talks about all the different table football games, they do a challenge, a bit like Top Gear used to do the race round thing. Well, they do a Subutio one, we have to flick, you have to chip it, it's great. So I headed down there, but before heading down there, part two of their DVD come out. This is the really rude part on my part. I ordered this. Been so, 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 so busy, I haven't had a chance to watch this until after I've been down there. So I'm recording this now, I've not watched this yet. But what I have done, I have been down to their studio and oh my God, oh. If you've seen their episodes on YouTube, if you've seen part one of their DVD, wow. Honestly, their collection makes my collection look like, well, makes it look like chump change, makes it look like nothing. Their collection is truly, truly amazing. And if you hang around to the end of this video, I've got a little backstage tour. So you can see exactly, so you can see some real, real gems, and I'll take you through that. But what I thought would be really cool, right? I thought it'd be cool if I sit down right now and watch it. So off I go. I'm going to disappear now. I'm going to go get some popcorn, and then I'm going to hit the sofa again. So this, this DVD picks up pretty much where the other DVD starts in 1966, talks about the heavyweights, it then talks about the zombies, it then talks about going into lightweights and the machine prints and them awesome, awesome, awesome kits. But the best bit, right, I'll tell you what I like best about both these DVDs, is as they're going through talking about table football and Subutio and the other games, what, what's the one they talk about in part two, what's the one I just see in this big league, never actually heard of it, Total Action Soccer, I used to have that when I was a kid as well, but I haven't got it anymore. But as they're going through, what they do, they talk about football as it's going along and they replicate classic games. So they replicate the 1999 Champions League final, they replicate Arsenal doing the double in 1971, and I'll tell you, things like that, <laughs> it's so cool. People making stuff happen with Sabutio. It's wicked. So honestly, I wish I'd watched that DVD before I went down to see the to see the guys, but honestly, wow. I'll tell you what, I got down now. I walked in their room. I walked in I, walk, I walked in their Sabutio studio. Oh my god, the table set up everywhere. There is Sabutio everywhere. I'm always quite humble, I think, about my collection being quite small, but wow, their collection makes mine look like nothing. Do you want to have a little look? I was able to take some footage. Let's go on a little tour. Let's go on a little wander around their... Uh, I suppose you call it the studio, the Sabutio studio. Wow, go and, let's, let's go and check it out. So look at all of that. Look at all them big leagues. Look at them lightweights. The super stock of the different stuff here, honestly. 
It's amazing. We've got Zuego stuff. Look at all them floodlights. Come in all. And Munich. See that Munich? So he had two Munich box sets. One, that one there, another one which is pristine. This is the pristine one. Oh my God, look, you've got the maroon goalkeepers. You've got the scoreboard. The floods, everything in this box is perfect. Absolutely perfect. It was up there. Look, look at it for total action football. The, diff the football express. The training pitch, that's what you do your um, challenge on. The new footy boxes, everything is there. Look, look at this Munich, look at it. You've got the flag, you've got the numbers, you've got the logbook, you've got Ken Bailey, you've got the interchangeable goalkeepers, the whistle. Everything is there. I've never seen a Munich set. And this one was absolutely mint, honestly. What a piece. Just to see one is amazing. Oh. That's for the scoreboard, the lamps for the scoreboard. Just looking at it again makes me so excited. It's like the holy grail for so many collectors, isn't it? Wow. Look at all these lightweights, just lightweights hung up like they're in a shop. Look at them big leagues. The training pictures just showed you. Their stadium they've got set up with metal goals. They've got the big cat goalkeepers they play with. That's what they actually play on when they have games. It looks amazing. The detail. Oh, oh it makes me so jealous. Flicky, they've got flicking goalkeepers on the side. That's the beauty of hockey. Pegasus, five aside. Look at all the rugby's. Just look at it. Grand Prix, different games. Toy guns. You never know toys, probably got it in there. <laughs> The five-a-side pitches, all the different five-a-sides, all the different tabletop football games. Honestly, the place is immense. And then over here, got a modern setup as well. And then teams, boxes, stadiums. They've got the Sabutio record, 4-2-4 games away. You know a team, it was probably in there, honestly. And look at them all, just stacked up casually. Rules of Fistiff, the training pack. Got rosettes, different box sets. Honestly, feel free to slow this down. Have a pull it, blow football at the bottom. Honestly, what a collection these guys have put together. It's amazing. <laughs> How cool is their collection, right? The guys over there have got an amazing collection and it's good to see people doing more Sibutio on YouTube. Their channel's cool. I love the fact that they're doing a challenge, it's great because different people are going to go on there. It's something complete, it's something new. It makes me feel less lonely on YouTube, the fact that I'm not the only person talking about it. Go over and check out their channel, honestly. I'll leave a link in the description below. I strongly suggest as well, you go on to, you go on to Spute Your World and you buy these DVDs. This isn't a paid promotion, right? I bought these myself, okay? I did not, I did not get sent these. I never do it. I say this, I've started saying this live in the last couple of weeks. I don't get paid to promote this stuff. I just buy it if I like it, I like it. If I don't like it, I'll probably say something. I generally seem to like everything to be myself. So I don't really say too much, but. So it sounded a little bit different this week. Kind of a DVD review, if you like. A little bit of backstage at the newest YouTube Subutio channel, Table Football Monthly. I'll be back in the subby study next week, whether it's flicking some figures or whether it's doing something. I've got, I've got a little project coming up. There might be a couple of videos before that actually comes on, but if you go over to my Instagram, if you go over to my Twitter and my Facebook, you might see what's, what I'm up to, so that's quite exciting. But until then, subscribe to the channel. I'll let you all go. I'm going to go and tidy up the popcorn I've dropped down all on the floor. Have a lovely week. I'll see you all very soon. And as always, keep on flicking. <laughs>